hi everyone uh, so in this video we will be uh, targeting to check a very basic thing when you it's come to automation uh, though it's ba basic right but everyone must have encountered it while uh, their initial automation right where you get an error say session not created uh, which uh, is mainly due to compatibility issue right so what i'll do i'll just try creating a class okay and I'll just write a piece of code and I'll show you exactly what error you get and how you can uh, get it fixed, right? So first what I'll do, I'll just create a class here. So simple, right click, you have a class, right? So let me just uh, uh, session connection check. Okay, I'll just... Uh, of this public static void main i'll finish it uh okay uh before proceeding actually what i mean before uh doing any automation right you need your a uh, driver for chrome right so uh, just for showing an example i have uh, already downloaded here this one is the would be the one which you can say is often mismatch compatibility and this latest is something which will be of a match compatibility now how i have concluded that right that could be the question so let me just go to your chrome okay uh, just click on this go to help and then about google chrome right what it will do is it will tell you the version of your chrome so if you see here my version is somewhere starting from 89.0.4389 right so very basic thing what you need to do is while downloading your driver right make sure you are downloading something of this version right so just let me try downloading it so you'll be getting this you can go here just click on this and you could see here it is saying chrome version starting with 8990 right so all you need to do is you need to download this one if you right click on this right you will be seeing the last modified date it is somewhere between uh, again in jan 2021 so you can just download based on your uh, OS what you are using right so I'm using Windows while so I'll, I'll be downloading this one right now let me just go and see if it is working or not right so what we will be doing here is normal web driver then your chrome then your driver and here you will be giving the path okay so i'll just and you'll be terminating it with a semicolon let me do that now what i'll do is i will be just showing you the one which will have a compatibility issue okay because I mean while recording this I just tried this one with an older version and I was able to find the error dot exe okay now you will be initializing your driver okay, D should be capital done to this you need to now it you have to import yeah same goes for web driver so now here we are we 
we'll do navigate to and to I'll be giving the URL say you give anything I'm just giving facebook.com and now I will just try to run this okay so see I have run it from the top and now see what will happen so if you could see my driver I mean the browser I mean it got open for an instance and later it got closed now if you see the error what I was talking earlier session not created right and it is saying this version of Chrome driver only support Chrome version 76 right so I mean if I have to just keep it short the session not created exception if you see generally you will be getting only for a case where the uh, browser what you are using and the driver what you have selected right if they are not uh, if there is a variation to that okay so now what I need to do is as I have showed you how you will be downloading the latest driver so I will be now giving this path so there is nothing more it's just that inside the chrome driver I just need to add a latest part here yeah so I'll just add rest just I'll check if everything yeah it should be working now so let me just maximize my window also dot windows dot maximize yeah then it's terminated with a semicolon now I'll be just try running it and assuming this will work so now if you could see what exactly URL I have given it is opening that okay it maximized my screen also and yeah it served the purpose so yeah that is what exactly I showed you can try and just let me know if it is working for you or not thank you uh, see you in next video